a full spread in the tablet for 35 men about to become models for the Catholic Church in the United States. Many priests didn't want those. If you, if you look back to those days, very few dioceses had deacons. But those like Ramon Lima, part of the first class of deacons in the Diocese of Brooklyn, still heard their calling, although there was a silence in the church for nearly a thousand years. The role of the deacon is biblical, mentioned in the Acts of the Apostles, but somewhere the vocation fell off, not to be revived again until the Second Vatican Council. The, the, the minds, the big minds, didn't know exactly what to do. In 1997, the Diocese of Brooklyn ordained one of the first diaconate programs in the country. Deacons started with little responsibilities beyond administering sacraments. Over time, however, as the number of men joining the priesthood slowed, the duties of the deacon grew, and so did their class size. But when you are a formation, then you, you mold the person in such a way that the person follow a dream. Since the day he stepped to the altar to accept his orders, Deacon Lima has watched 416 other men follow in Brooklyn and Queens, and close to 17,000 across the United States. You know, part of making those decisions, so uh, there were some sleepless nights that went along with that. Ordained in 1993, Deacon Richard Gilligan says the ministry became a full-time job for many men, ripe with responsibilities. He'll never forget preaching the gospel during a mass with St. John Paul II. Didn't sleep the whole night before. I was afraid to sleep because I, I didn't want to miss it. Deacon John Sands from the class of 77 went from working on Wall Street to ministering to the homeless and sick. Deacons are called to minister outside. That's where we're needed. Look around at people today. With the vocation of permanent deacons on the rise and those during the priesthood slowing, more deacons are taking on tasks previously held by their pastors. In the Diocese of Brooklyn, Bishop DiMarzio is assigning deacons to be parish managers, so priests may be relieved to do more active work in their community. I think the men going forward, the ones that are going to be ordained after me, uh, they're going to have a tremendous uh, responsibility because of the way the church is changing. But changes are part of their vocation. They always have been. Deacons say they'll continue to serve and minister however Christ calls them. In Queens, Katie Angusser, Currents News.